Right here, how to EGD learners, welcome to this tutorial showing you two ways of constructing a hexagon. The first one we will do where they actually give us the base of a hexagon and the or the prescribed length of a side. So we're starting off by drawing that first line, which in this case is 60 millimeters. Once you've got the base of the hexagon, set your compass on the same length as this base and get a center, mid-center here. Okay, we're going to use this center point as the center of a circle at the same radius as this base. So we're keeping it at the same distance and we draw an arc in construction. All right, now all you're going to do is you're going to walk your compass all around. You can start any side and you're going to make marks as we go along. And what you will notice is actually a hexagon being formed here. Okay, and it all lines up. So these are the corners of our hexagon. Once you've done that, you can use any ruler or triangle and you're going to complete Right, that's our hexagon drawn when you have a base. Let's say, for instance, they now give you in another option the center. Okay, I'll just do a center line here quickly. Okay, in this question, they now ask draw a hexagon with a center at this point, and they say the base length is 60. Okay. What we're going to do is, we're going to take our compass, we set it on 60 millimeters. Alright, and we're going to start off here in the middle and draw our arc. Alright, there we go. Now, choose a side, depending on the rotation of this hexagon, you're going to use that same radius and you are going to mark off on that circumference your six points used for this construction. So you've got again one, two, three, four, five, and six, and with your triangle you can go draw that in. Right, so these are two same same but different ways of drawing a hexagon. Now it's your turn. Mm -hmm. 